was really pleased with the way we started the game and we talked all week about just kind of bringing up our level. Uh, we felt like, you know, we've been practicing pretty well uh, overall, but we've had some ups and downs and, and we just wanted to come out and start fast. And I thought we did that. Uh, I thought defensively we really bothered them at the beginning of the game and we got our transition going, especially in the first half. I mean, there weren't a whole lot of half court offensive sets and that's the way that we want to play. Um, and so just, just really happy with our players of focusing in on kind of what our keys were to come out and have a good performance today. Yeah, I mean, I would say generally I thought our offense was good today because we took the right shots from the right people. And when we do that, our offense is very good. And um, it's clear from the stat sheet, shooting 50% and 14 assists that we were doing that. Um, I think Octavia um, played really well um, for a freshman getting her first start. I know she had some jitters. She admitted that before the game. Um, but I thought she came under, came out and got her feet under her pretty quickly. And she's a kid that's going to be able to score a lot of points uh, for us. She's confident with the ball. Um, she makes the right plays. Being such a young player has a, has a high basketball IQ and is able to finish against contact. So um, I would expect to see more games like that from her. I mean, I think you always want to peak around February, March. You want to play your best basketball going into the, the playoffs. But, um, you know, we also need to start the season well. I mean, we have a really tough non-conference schedule for us, and uh, we want to be able to battle some of these teams and start to get some of the kinks out. But as far as me knowing exactly when uh, for this team, it's hard to say just because we have so much chemistry to build. I mean, to be honest, I was really pleased with what we looked like today because it was much better um, from scrimmaging a week ago. I mean, dramatically better. So. I think the one thing I do love about this team is they want to be good. They just don't know how completely yet. And so they're hungry and they take criticism well. And, um, you know, so that, that, that's a really good thing, but it'll still take some time for us to mesh. Yeah, I thought Laya had a great game tonight. Number one, she did exactly what we needed her to do. She ran the offense. She controlled the tempo. She took care of the ball. She, she um, pushed well in transition and she took really good shots. So one thing we've been on her about is shooting more. And we need that out of her this year. And uh, she's been willing to do that. But I do think overall she has accepted that she's a leader. You know, the last couple of years, um, even though she was playing the point guard, which is a natural leadership position, she really fought that. You know, it wasn't what she wanted to do. And I, I think she's accepted the fact that being an upperclassman, uh, we need that from her. And I, I've been really proud of uh, her stepping up vocally for this team. Uh, being really more, a lot more engaged uh, on the court, you know, as you know, you need your point guard to be looking back at the coach and be that, you know, that that coach on the floor. And I think that she's accepted that role really well, and it's going to pay off for our team. Um, I think that we all played very well together. We moved the ball well. We had a lot of assists. Um, I think that our newbies came in, played well, played their roles. Pretty excited about today's win. The thing is here at Charlotte, like, we're really a family. Like We love each other on the court, we love each other off the court, and I feel like you can see that and you can feel it. So when our newbies get in or when um, our reserves get in, we're going to cheer for them just as hard as we want them to cheer for the starters whenever we start the game. doesn't matter. Um, I work on looking at the rim because I don't do that sometimes, and that's kind of um, something that they tell me that I need to really do. I'm trying to be an effective scorer in the post, and I'm trying to keep our, my field goal percentage high so I can help keep my team's field goal percentage high. Um, I think it's exciting because I'm glad that like we really played well so that everybody can see that at this level, you're good. Like You're here and you, you fit in with the team. So now we have to up our game a little bit more for a very good Duquesne team on Friday. And we're going to go into practice on Monday just focusing on getting better.